Hey everybody. Um, so long time no see, right? I have not made a video in a minute. <laughs> okay, so here I am. I'm really sorry it's taking me so long. It's just been crazy. I mean, life has just been a little crazy. So, but I am back and I didn't film any unboxings last month. So I figured this month I'm just going to I'll show you what I got for June and then I will show you what I got for May. So I'll start out with the current month and then do the previous month after. Okay, because I know some of you are uh, clicking on for this month. So let's do Ipsy first. So for the month of June, the theme is Rebel Rebel. The bag is so cute. Look at this bag. Ipsy and it's very uh, some kind of animals fighting outside. <laughs> That's weird. Okay, so very graffiti and it's got the purple, so it's very pretty. All right, first thing we have is a brush cleaner by Japanesque. It's a solid brush cleaner, gentle goat milk cleansing balm. And show you that. It smells really good. It has an, it, it kind of reminds me of that perfume by Dolce & Gabbana, light blue. So it smells really good. It's not too overpowering. Um, yeah, so I can't wait to use this. I do like solid brush cleaners, so I'm excited about that. Then, okay. <sighs> ah, Mark Anthony Dream Waves Beach Spray. Create sexy, tousled beach waves all year long. I have to tell you, I'm so tired of getting these sea salt sprays. I'm not... <laughs> I don't like the way my hair feels when I get home from the beach. It's it's not a look that I like and I'm trying to achieve. So I don't know. I probably won't use this. I don't know. Ugh. It smells like kind of like coconut, but really bad, <laughs> bad coconut. I don't like that. Okay, so I'm not too thrilled about that. Then we have this pen. It's a Kajal Waterline Eyeliner in Intense Black by Visanti. Now this is really nice. I'm wearing it now. It went on the waterline so easily. Oh, as you can see, I mean, it's very black and It goes on the waterline super easily. Like you, you don't even really have to touch. It's just like butter. So this is really nice. And I did try it the other night. Um, it lasted a really long time. So yeah, I do like that. I adjusted the lighting so I look a little brighter right now. <laughs> okay, so that is good. And then we have this. Seraphine Botanicals Happy Hibiscus. It's a 99% natural blush for all skin tones. So it is a blush and I have it on right now. Although all you can see is this highlight. You guys, I got the Marc Jacobs highlighter. That's a whole nother video, but look at this. But the blush is really nice. You can't I kind of diffused it a little bit because when I went to put it on it was very intense like I was like oh hello it was like so let me show you a sequence this little package just like that has a little mirror I really love this color look at that and it does have a little bit of well no it is pretty matte but it's a really pretty rose color so that I really like. It's vegan, GMO free, gluten free. So that's good. I like it. 
And then the last thing is this Urban Decay Eyeshadow and Fireball. I am actually wearing this one as well on my lids. You can see it. Hang on. So. I'm wearing it on my lids. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's a really adorable sample. Like, look at this. It's so little. It's like the size of my thumbnail. But it's really pretty. Okay, so. Oh, it's very buttery. Very soft. Has a nice sheen. It's very pretty. So, yeah, it's like a. It's hard to explain. It's kind of. Like a rosy color with a light pink shift to it. I think it is a duochrome. I'm not 100% sure. But, um, yeah, I really like that as well. So, that was my June bag and if you want to see what I got for May keep watching <laughs> all right so May was Des destination chic it's like a travel theme and here's the bag it has all kinds of really cool things on it like the Eiffel Tower Big Ben Statue of Liberty Easter Island all kinds of things it has this little envelope opening and they had a lot of different colors you could get, you know, some people got pink and there was blue or whatever. So, first thing, I got a brush. This is by Inspire, I-N-S-P-R, but this is a really nice brush. Um, it would be a nice little light crease brush. Very soft, like that. Okay, then we got this. This is, what is this? Clark's Botanicals Smoothing Marine Cream. It says apply evenly to entire face once or twice daily. Can also be used on the back of the hands. <laughs> Follow with sunscreen. Never apply this product to red or peeling skin. Yeah, so just a cream has kind of a in like a light incensey smell so I'll try it I don't know then we have Smashbox X-rated mascara I'm not going to open this because I have so many mascaras open right now <laughs> and we got this Pacifica natural mineral coconut eyeshadow trio I've gotten one similar to this before I've heard mixed things about this as well here are the colors. Um, I don't know. Let's see. Not very pigmented. So if you like a natural look, you might like this. Uh, yeah, so they're very shimmery. Um, yeah, I don't know. Oh, so so about it. <laughs> okay, so, but that is a nice little trio. They sent three sheet masks. As you can see, I actually did one. <laughs> Believe it or not, I did a sheet mask. Um, and these are so AE. One is Firming and Elasticity, this is Collagen, and then this one is Propolis Collagen Essence Mask, Lifting and Radiance. And this one was for Smooth Radiance, Brightening Collagen Face Mask. This is the one I did for brightening. I don't know. I am not a huge fan of these. Okay, I had to... <sighs> My camera's having issues still. And I had to go check into some really creepy noises. So I'm back, and uh, let's see if I can get through this video. <laughs> All right, so I was talking about these things. Um, I did the face mask. And I didn't care for the way it felt. It was like cold and slimy, 
And I know most face masks are that way. Um, this is not my thing, but it, it was okay. I left it on the whole time and um, I didn't see any major differences in my skin or anything, but you know, I guess they're worth a try every now and then. So anyway, that is that and that is uh, Ipsy for May. Okay. Oh, and then also, I forgot that I had um, cashed in some of my Ipsy points, and I got a couple of these lip lacquers from Model Co. Um, yeah, so, let's see what I got here. I was really surprised that they're like little samples. I thought they'd be like, you know, real full size, but they aren't. So this one is in Socialite. I haven't really tried these yet. It's a little, hmm, let's see. Okay. So basically it's a lip gloss. It smells nice. It has kind of a strawberry smell. So this one's a little, like, looks strawberry. <laughs> and then this one is in Morocco. So... And this one is a nice nude mauvey color. Uh, yeah, it's real nude, actually. So, it's like this one right here. So, yep. Yeah. I like lip glosses. So, yeah, I cashed in some points. I'm not, I might have been like two, probably 250, I think. 250 points. And that's that. Um, all right, so I'll see if I can do another video. We'll see how it goes. Um, thank you guys for watching. I will leave my Ipsy link below if you would like to sign up. And that's it. Oh, it's $10 a month in case you don't know already. $10 a month for the subscription. Okay, I think that's all. Take care. See you later. Love you. Bye.